Well, hello, Andy Bassist, coming at you once again, and this week, a bit of an out there one. This is the Plague Pit from Holy Island Audio. Obviously, um, some members of the channel and some people in the channel who follow me or who follow me on Instagram will know how much I love their mountain mover, and that is like, it's basically a 50-50 draw, I think, possibly, with uh, my favourite fuzz of all time. And I just, I hit up Holy Island, and because I saw about their plague pit, which is basically, they make a pedal called the Abracadaver, which is sort of a weird octave fuzz. Um, but the plague pit basically adds, it's two of them in one box, and it's more gain on each of them. And rather than the abracadaver which is basically just a knobless box um there's just a foot switch and that's that's all the control you have obviously there's internal trim pots i believe this one has basically moved those controls to the outside so you have clang and volume obviously volume is self-explanatory clang is the amount of that upper octave that is sort of in the circuit and you hear so basically, obviously, this box has two, so they're in series, one into the other, left or right into left. Uh, you can use them independently, as you can see, there's two switches on the pedal, so you can use one or the other or both together. But yeah, so I figured this is how it sounds on bass, and then I've got a truly ridiculous sound to put towards the end. But this is, I've, I've chatted for way too long, let's just get into some sound. So this, I thought for this, it'd be apt to use my Troy Sanders, which is, uh, unless anyone's wondering, it's tuned ADAD. -AD. So, uh, like the bottom of a five string drop. So this is the clean sound. This is, I believe, a matte amp profile in my Kemper. Just to prove both sides are the same. But therein lies the fun that you can obviously send one into the other. So for the first one, it's what you've heard. The second one that I'm going to stack on top has got a lot more of the of the upper octave in. And that, quite simply, is the plague bit. Um, if you want, like I say, if you don't want to have two, just go and get the abracadaver. But obviously, that won't have your clang and volume controls on the outside. It's just sort of a one-hit wonder. It's sort of made to go after fuzzes, which brings me on to my next point, because it's in the loop with a the mountain move, uh, Holy Island Mountain Mover before it, and it has a damnation audio or soap box workshop uh, spike box after it. So it basically can create a sound that sounds like the end of the world so, um, and has more gain than anyone needs. What I'll do is I'll put the mountain mover on and then I'll add the that one side of the abracadabra that we've heard.
yeah, that was the plague pit and a lot of other nonsense. <laughs> Until next time. Cheers, guys.